Oh, that's a foul. Uh oh, uh oh, see? Oh. oh, no, 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 no. You don't want any of that. You don't need that. And now the officials step in as CJ McCollum takes issue with Alex Lynn. That quickly escalated. And fists may have been thrown. It appeared they were. We'll take a look as, of course, you know, the folks in Secaucus will. And the officials here tonight as well. That escalated quickly. Looks like it starts off with Lynn trying to set a screen. CJ meets him with the right arm just to try to navigate the screen. Then shoves him, and then another shove, and then another shove, and then it quickly escalated from there. Well, the hands were balled up, but there were no fists thrown. Just a, another day in the backyard for CJ Ken Ohio with his brother Eric. Just going at it. This happens in the game of basketball, guys get heated. And Lynn didn't get to this level by being a finesse player. Let's Not put at it all. that way. Not at all. Lynn, a seven year pro out of Maryland. But it's still a jab. Take a look. Well, both players At have the their end. hands balled up. Boom. Boom. Full on push from CJ. Watch the Washington land left arm. They both have hands up. Yeah, it's a jab for the left hand. Yep. Kind of a weak little lead. It's an automatic ejection, whether a punch connects or not. Foul, well, they're calling an offensive foul on Atlanta, double technical, so on Atlanta and on CJ McCullough. So simply offsetting technical fouls. Double meaning two, not double technical, thus ejection on the players. So they're saying no punch. They're going to play on it. I think they got it right. The big question is now what does this mean as it pertains to the game? Does this fire up the Blazers in a way that they go on a run? You certainly hope so. 